Teacher Lab and for today's lesson, we will be learning about network cables and its types. What is a network cable? A network cable is a device that is used to connect two computers to share a device such as a printer or to connect other network devices. Cables are used to connect and transfer data between switch, routers, data storage, IP phones, and other network products. To make data transmission more extensible than a simple peer-to-peer -peer network, network designers use specialized network devices such as hubs, switches, routers, and wireless access points to send data between devices. These cables are essentially the carrier through which data flows. There are different types of network cables and these are the following. Twisted pair cables, fiber optic cables, USB cables, Ethernet cables, coaxial cables, and patch cables. Twisted pair cables. It is a type of cabling that is used for telephone communications. This type of cable is suitable for home and corporate internet networks. These are the types of twisted pair cables. Unshielded twisted pair, a cable that has two or four pairs of wires. This type of cable relies solely on the cancellation effect produced by the twisted wire pairs that limit signal degradation caused by electromagnetic interface and radio frequency interference. The next type of twisted pair cable is shielded twisted pair. Each pair of wire foil to better shield the wires from noise is wrapped in metallic foil to better shield the wires from noise. STP reduces electrical noise from within the cable. It also reduces EMI and RFI from outside the cable. Optic cable is a network cable that are designed for long-distance, high-performance data networking and telecommunications. Compared to wired cables, fiber optic cables provide higher bandwidth and transmit data over long distances. Fiber optic cables support much of the world's internet, cable televisions, and telephone systems. Two types of fiber optic cables Multi-mode A multi-mode is a cable that has thicker core than single-mode cable. It is easier to make, can use simpler light sources such as LEDs, and work well over distances of a few kilometers or less. Second one is single mode. A single mode is a cable that has a very thin core. It is harder to make, uses laser as a light source, and transmits signals dozens of kilometers with ease. Next is USB cable. USB cable is also known as universal serial bus. It is a type of hardware interface that was developed so that peripheral devices like computer mice, keyboards, printers, digital cameras, and the likes can be easily connected to the computer. Another type of a network cable is an Ethernet cable. Ethernet cables are everywhere and often called as the backbone of the wired network world. Typically, Ethernet cables are used to provide an internet connection and connect devices to a local network. The most common use for an Ethernet cable is connecting a Wi-Fi router or 
modem to the internet entry port or a telephone line. Coaxial cable. This cable is commonly used by cable operators, telephone companies, and internet providers around the world to convey data, video, and voice communications to customers and distribution of cable television signals. Types of coaxial cables first type is what we call the RG6. RG6 is a higher quality cable than RG59, with more bandwidth and less susceptible to interference. The next one is RG59. It is a specific type of coaxial cable, often used for lower power video and RF signal connections. It is commonly used for cable television. And the last one is patch cables. A patch cable is used to connect two optical or electronic devices or to create an infrastructure for signal routing. And that ends our video lesson for today. See you next time. Thank you. Be safe. God bless.